Well, it's Thursday, and I'm outside here on my deck. And I just listened to Martin Zender's show. Truly tremendous. I'm going to give you some brutal truth here of how I grew up. I grew up in a system, religious system, where even masturbation was a sin. Like, as a little boy coming in to puberty, it was wrong to have a heart on. Wrong to masturbate. And this is it. Okay? God rescued me out of that crap. It took a while, like many years, right, to come out of that shit. That religious shit that was planted into me. So that's the thing. You know, I believe there's many believers who have been abused in some sort of fashion during their life. Well, are you still trapped in the abuse? Are you a victim? Or are you a survivor? Are you one who's going to stand up in Christ and say that you are truly free in Christ? Okay? The natural is not given in the religious systems. The natural, it's unnatural in the religious. Unnatural. And this is what makes those ones who are addicted to shit. This still produces it. But thank God, God rescued me out of it. And I totally, totally appreciate Martin and, and what he professes because yes, there are many who are addicted to everything. Alcohol, sex, you think about it, right? And this is why I'm commenting on it today. I'm going to read a passage in Romans. <laughs> and it's interesting because God gives them actually over to it. God didn't give me over to the freaking religious crap that I was brought up in. Okay, and it's Romans chapter 1, verse, starting in verse 24. Wherefore, God gives them over in the lusts of their hearts to the uncleanliness of dishonoring their bodies among themselves. Those who alter the truth of God into the lie and are venerated and offer divine service to the creature rather than the creator who is blessed for the eons. Amen. Therefore, God gives them over to dishonorable passions for their females besides alter the natural use into that which is beside nature. Likewise, also the males besides leaving the natural use of the female were inflamed in their craving for one another. Males with males effecting indecency and getting back in themselves the retribution of their deception. Which must be. God gives them over. So that must be. And according as they do not test God to have him in recognition, God gives them over to a disqualified mind to do that which is not befitting, filled with all injustice, wickedness, evil, greed, distended with envy, murder, strife, guile, depravity, whisperers, villifers, detesters of God, outrage, outragers, proud, ostentatious, inventors of evil things. Stubborn to parents, unintelligent, perfidious, without natural affection. Implacable, unmerciful, those who recognizing this just statute of God, that those committing such things are deserving of death, not only are doing them, but are endorsing also those who are committing them. So you see that right there in Romans. How many people read that passage of scripture and understand it? What I'm saying is that God has graced me in the sense of bringing me through that religious crap growing up that everything was a sin, everything, I mean everything, and I go to masturbation, yeah, all right? Here's a young boy who gets a heart on, but it's evil and wicked to the one fucking religious woman that taught me this, said, oh, it's evil to get a heart on, it's evil to play with yourself, it's evil 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 it's a sin well this is the whole point right god did not give me over to it he rescued me out of it so you got to understand if you're trapped in your sin and you're trying to fix yourself and you don't oh can't do this can't do that it's bullshit be free in christ what i'm saying is be free in christ no joke and i love martin show today because that's clarity right there clarity be free understand that you are free and then you won't be obsessed by it and then you won't try to fix yourself make sense 
All right. I love you all, and this has been a wonderful, 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 wonderful topic. Have a great Thursday.